Hey, I got this for uh, for Christmas. It is an eLearnTronics, eLearnTronics, Advanced Learning Board Logic Gates. All right, um, got a bag parts. Here's the little PC board. Learn your logic. So what it is is a whole bunch of um, transistor level gates, an AND gate, a OR, and NOT, NOR, NAND, XNOR, XOR, and here's the uh, logic for the, uh, for all of the uh, truth tables. So yeah, pretty cool. Um, I don't see a instruction manual anywhere, but I bet you it is self-evident. There's probably a website somewhere. Um, so it should be, let's see, where's my tray? Uh-oh, I've misplaced my tray. There it is, get it onto a tray. Nice. Oh, here we go. For instructions and free lessons, Go to elearntronics.com. All right, well, I think we need to instruct. I never read the manual. Everybody knows I don't read the manual. Let's see here. Let's take a look at this. Zoom back up. Uh, we got a whole bunch of resistors. Uh, they are different values. Uh, okay, no, they're marked on the board. Okay, they're marked on the board. And. And yeah, I don't think I need to uh, do anything. I bet you these are all NPN. That would be my guess. They are all... Ooh, that's too small. My eyes are not that good anymore. Not anymore. These are... 547s. Not familiar with that transistor. And these are 547s. Yeah, so all the same transistor. They're all NPN. And, uh, yeah, that's all you need. So, yeah, let's get it built. All right, what do I say? Flat things first. Flat things first. Let's put in the, uh, let's put in the 10Ks. My favorite resistor. If you haven't learned that by now. Welcome to any new viewers. The new year. Hope everybody started out the new year correctly. Everything is doing well. Companies have a problem with money at the end of the year, and a lot of times that's when they lay people off. Welcome to the holidays. You've been laid off. I've seen that way, 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 way too many times. Yeah. I knew somebody who got laid off during their honeymoon. <laughs> Jeez, they'd gone off to Thailand, some little island, beautiful islands over in Thailand. I don't know if they were on Phuket or uh, one of those islands anyway. They were on their wonderful honeymoon and my boss called her up to uh, tell her she would not have a job when she came back home. How's that? Happy New Year. Happy. I think it was kind of in the same time, too. It was like, it was like, it was the New Year. She was getting married. It's like all the stuff was happening in her life. And yeah, you just lost your job. Oh, well. Sometimes it sucks being a boss. I had to lay off people when I was a boss. It's not fun. It is not fun. Then they make you feel bad because <laughs> some of the people I've laid off came to me and says, yeah, I know you had to do it. You know, don't feel bad. They tried, tried, they tried to console me <laughs> for having to lay them off. That just makes you feel like a schmuck. Oh, man. All right. Smoky today. Maybe 
Maybe I should turn on my fan. Turn on my fan. Hopefully it won't be too noisy. I don't run my fan usually because it it makes noise, but let me uh, uh just have to put up with it. It's going right in my face. That's better. I get a lot of comments on the fan. Um, I just have a cable tied to my uh, ice and it just just creates a little bit of wind that keeps the smoke from the rosin headed in the other direction. Ow! Ouch, 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 I've got a lead, a lead stuck on my finger. Ouch, drew blood. Ouch. Ouch. It happens with these new super tiny leads on things back in the old days. The leads were big and fat, and they usually didn't break the skin. <laughs> These little ones do. Ow! Ow, look, blood. I'm side blood. Jeez. Hopefully I have enough pallets these days. Not your clotting clotting factor in blood is how many your pallet count or something like that. You got like some big fat things that jam into the hole. <laughs> There's a hole. I don't know how blood clotting works. I'm just glad I have it. Lots of 10Ks. There's going to be a lot of things on this board. My uh, wife likes doing jigsaw puzzles, so I got her a, a jigsaw puzzle for Christmas. and. Uh, of course, it's not a one-person thing. It's everybody, everybody in the house needs to go help on the jigsaw puzzle. One of those thousand, thousand-piece puzzles. I haven't done one of those for a while. She likes doing the little jigsaw puzzles online. It makes a lot more sense, you know. <laughs> this thing filled up our kitchen table so it's nice to have it gone we finished it today it was missing a piece though it came with three extra pieces but then it was missing one piece um, now we're not sure if it was actually missing a piece or maybe inside dog uh, ate it <laughs> we, don't, we don't know <laughs> we found we found one piece in his mouth or we think so but he was a good boy and dropped it. He may have eaten another one though. I don't know. He may have been sneaky. He he has a habit of uh, taking fetishes of people. You know, socks, of course. Not not 
clean socks. They have to be dirty socks, of course. But he'll like, um, like if I'm working on something, maybe I'll drop a something on the floor, and he'll he'll know that he's not supposed to have it, and so he'll take it. He's a good boy. He doesn't eat things, um, not things that are not edible, right? Like transistor or something. I don't know. <laughs> he hasn't eaten a transistor, but but he'll tell, he'll like find things. And then he'll hide them under his pillow and just keep them. Like, this was, this was my master's, and I'm going to keep a memento. <laughs> and he does that. It's kind of funny. He's a good boy. Pretty new kit. It's got a date of 2020 on it. Oh. Somebody still thinks that people are interested in digital electronics at the component level. So hats off to them. So much of electronics is being just it's disappearing just in cat in the CAD programs and and the CAD programs do most of the thinking for you. So yeah. Good in some ways and sad in others. I like that one. That's a little shorter. Oops. I don't like the looks of that one. Cut that one off a little shorter. There we go. That's better. Now I'll short out. Oh, wait. let me uh, let me put down all the trans all the uh, resistors and I'll come back. All right, so I just went ahead and loaded it up, and uh, there we go. Looks really really nice. Lots of LEDs. So these are the LEDs that are inputs A and B. So when you push A and you push B, with these little buttons down here, those are your inputs to your gates, and then the outputs will be the other things here. Comes with a little power connector here. Oops, for a uh, nine volt battery. We'll just hook up uh, hook up our power supply pretend to be a 9 volt battery so we will go on there like that and then uh, there's an on off switch so we will turn that on and we have some on already so we would be a zero zero state not uh, would be not a and not B so those are the knots we have nor which is either one not so that should go off, that should go off, and then when we have both on, they're both off. That's good. Uh, and gate, this should be when they're both on. And they are, maybe, yes. Or should be either one, but not both. Oh, no, either one and both. Yeah, yeah, so we look at the logic here. Uh, NAND should be uh, both on, should be off. Yep, that's right. Uh, exclusive or should be one or the other, but not both. And that is. And exclusive or should be one or the other, but not both, but the inverted gate. There you go. So you can learn all of your logic right here on this board and in these truth tables, which are a little bit hard to read, um, but they do have a website. Um, so it is it is a cool little board, and I think um, I think you could go through. Let's do that. So this would be a great exercise. Do not cheat. Um, let's just say we want to have an OR gate, okay? And so we have two inputs, and we want to have an OR function, okay? And we could have two transistors, okay? And one of them or both of them could be on, so we'll put, we'll put grounds here on those. So we have these here. So if they were up like this, Okay, you turn this one on, this one will go on, this one will go on. So here's an OR function, okay? You might have some resistors here, all right? So this is probably what the OR function looks like, right? And then you can say, well, what would an AND function look like? Well, we, again, we have a, 
we probably have two transistors. Um, and the AND might look like this, where, um, where both of these would have to be on in order to complete the circuit, right? And um, anytime you want a NOR function, you can just put a, uh, you can put a thing here on the output that inverts it, right? If it's high, it's low. If it's low, it's high. Um, and then, so maybe try to do it on your own, try to figure out what does an exclusive OR, how would you do an exclusive OR? Um, now those are a bit more complicated. Uh, so the uh, AND gate took two transistors, the OR gate took two transistors, the NOT function is just one each, um, the NOR is just two, the NAND is just two, but the exclusive ORs are six. It takes six transistors to do the exclusive OR function. So yeah, try to figure that one out. And uh, yeah, cute little board. Um, I think it's a bit overpriced, uh, but if you get it as a gift, it's much better.